Greetings, sir and sirettes, and welcome back to Albino Lullaby with me, Lathrix, and of course, our glorious grandmother, who is slumbering sweetly, even though we just took away a giant needle, force-feeding her what is essentially narcotics. So, let's continue, shall we? We are um, tracking the third line to release the final needle and thus waken the grandmother, which apparently is nothing like I imagined. Okay, so this goes down here, and then we have to, so we have to use the broken elevator. That seems, oh, very quick. Oh. That was good. We love you, Grandma! Their giant viewing area. Perhaps when she was smaller, she could fit here? I see power cables going both ways, and suspiciously placed blue lights. What are you? What do you do? You actually have a button? Doesn't seem like it. Aha! Click! No instant bad things? Normally bad things happen when I do that. Ah, bad things will happen when I press this button. We're being raised. Time to spring the trap. Yay, traps. I love traps. But this is my bridge. I have a zappy thing that says so. This is very dark again. Stop being so dark, game. Let me see things. I mean, this with the gamma increased. Okay, we're stuck on number four. Okay, well, they're coming out the w out of the woodwork like good little termites. Let's let them all stack up together so we can get a better hit with the weapon. Oh, I just barge in there and try to get straight through. I assume that's what I need to do is go through and use the doors they just came out of. But do I need to kill them all first, perhaps? Sounds reasonable to me! Fully charged again. I just realised all that. Okay, so they say respawn on the spot. I didn't realise that. Well, how am I meant to deal with this then? How do I get out of here? I've killed them all at once. Doesn't even class that as a door. Oh, that's went darker. So where do I go then? Unless those two buttons are now active. I don't know. Um, hello. They've all kind of split up now. And that's making this far, far worse. How about this? Aha! These two little buttons, I think, maybe do something. No, I was wrong. Okay. Oops. Turned on the weapon a little bit too slow there. Okay, let's try that again. Something seemed different with Grandmother. I worry the closing of this visiting elevator has got her down. They say we can still visit her in her new chamber, but that she's just getting too big. Oh, her folding flesh. So that's what I missed. Okay, so let's do what we did before, and let's face the enemies again. This time, hopefully, with a bit more um, success. So clearly it's something to do with those two cables. I'm just not sure what I'm actually meant to be clicking on. That's the problem. I just tried clicking on the actual wire itself and that did absolutely nothing. Come on then, all of you, get over here. 
Get them all clumped up if we can. And then we simply run past them and try again. And there's a bug that one over here. That's a shame. I think I just pressed that. Did I? They're both going from gr from green to red. That's the problem. By themselves. So clearly that's not what we meant to do. Unless there's a button on the inside, of course. Which there is! Aha! <laughs> I didn't see it last time. There we go. I think I've clicked them both. It's certainly gone a lot more green now. So now what do I do? Perhaps reactivate it? Is that all we need to do? Just reactivate it? Yes it is. Okay. Your trap was meaningless to me. Ah, oh, damn. A couple went from the flock. It's so much easier if you keep them in like one giant bunch. Damn, they have some creepy faces. You know, as much as the promise of happiness it does appeal to me from the one speaking over the microphone, so it tells me that isn't happiness. <laughs> I don't know what it is, just a kind of bizarre hint that that is not what I would call eternal joy. Silly maggot marshmallow worm thumbs. They do remind me of something, but can't for life of me remember what it is. Like a, a style of a different creature, but I can't think of what creature it is. Seriously, I stopped us again. Oh! Okay, so clearly we need to go through there because... Hush now, hush. Okay, they're all in a nice line. Let's let them get over here. They won't jump down if I jump down. Go on, stop getting stuck over there. No, you got stuck for so long, one of them... Bye, guys. Thanks for the exit. Uh, one, I suppose. Oh, we need both, okay. Back up we go. Nope, not now, not now. Too late, we're not losing now. Excuse me. You see, all you need to do is be polite with people. Oh. Not quite what I expected, but okay. Grandmother, I'm trying to help you. Ah. Should have got some charge from that machine, shouldn't I? Grandmother seems slightly angry. Click! So we have to wait for that one to do its full course, okay. And as soon as that's over... Grandmother, relax. You're simply waking up from a bad dream. Maybe she looked less creepy when she was smaller. Wait, it's gone red. This was green. Oh, when I died, did it reset? Oh, I'm gonna have to go and do that one again. That's fantastic. I'll probably just skip this out since we already did it before. Okay, that's back on. Also, that was really bugged out. All of the platforms and everything were in the position as if I had already completed that task, but the cord wasn't in. So that was really difficult to do, but um, yeah, we've did that. And the final needle is out. Good morning, Grandmother. I have no idea where I'm meant to be going now. Followed the correct arrow. What arrow? There's two arrows. Okay, we're going this arrow. Damn, that thing is creepy. 
grandmother wake up route. Okay. Bye, grandmother. Good morning. Kind of want to watch. Is there even a head? I don't think there is. I thought that might have been a note. This is horrible. Button. I don't know what that button just did, but I can't move anymore. Oh. Okay, she got me. Ow. Oh no. Oh no. 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 This can't be the end. No. <laughs> I don't want to be your mother, grandmother. Oh. Nope, I'm falling instead. Okay. Can I move? Something's gone horribly wrong. Um. What? <laughs> what? This whole game has been just what? Okay, I can control my camera again. Who? Is the worm dead? We heard there was a cave in. <laughs> Don't be cross with us. We didn't mean to let the worm out. Go back to Very creepy. Oh. Where do I go now? Do I jump onto the grandmother? Okay, fine. I'm glad we can't see this properly. Got got the insane ramblings of the of the narrator enemy in the background. I don't jump to this one. Mm, yes, okay. Into this one, into this one, into that one. I suppose into this one. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Now I don't know. Onto this. Yes. So it was the cave in, that's what caused it to stop eating. Okay, that's good. That was rather unfortunate. Okay, there we go. I'm assuming go out this way. Come on, grandmother. Don't you dare fall on me, spikes. Oh. Grandmother loves us all. We are alive. Yep. Is this meant to be the end of the ride for these? Stand up! You're back! You can walk again! Um... Okay... Soon all of this will be yours! Seats! TVs! Weird bathtubs! Fridges! When your memory returns... You'll possess a new body. Oh dear. Don't forget your souvenir slice of grandmother. Ooh. So I guess that's the end of the conversion process? Using the grandmother to... Oh, I'm still so confused. Okay, I can't get past it. Do I actually have to use the grandmother? No, I don't. Then how do I get out? That door's locked. 
and all of this is locked. So of course the big question to ask is where do I go? Can't get behind those. Oh, it opened by itself. Okay, I should just be patient. Reveal your new flesh. Show mirror. Oh god, there's one behind me. Hello, friend. That was... Welcome home, child. This concludes episode one of what? I mean albino lullaby from Aplor. I don't... That was definitely not me because I was looking behind me when I saw that thing. Because it made my mouse move. It wasn't me wanting to turn away from the mirror. Um... Unless the idea is that is me. And I've started to be converted? I... Give me all of your theories in the comments below, because honestly speaking, that has stumped me beyond belief. I am going to go ahead and look up some stuff on my own. Feel free to take your own conclusions, but of course, this is episode one. It's clearly not meant to give you an obvious answer, and I'm too stupid to see the abstract. So anyway, thank you so much for watching and sticking with me this far. If you have enjoyed this series, then of course, likes, favourites, shares, comments, all that good stuff helps out me, helps out the channel, and most importantly, shows that this type of game is a series you wish to see more of in the future. Less of the sandboxy buildy games, more of the story-driven games, which I do also adore. And maybe a few horrors along the way, so... Thank you so much for watching, and goodbye. I'll buy no lullaby, everyone. Available on Steam!